Hello everyone and welcome back to Elden Ring, where last time we found ourselves in a lake of rot. Very nice. And uh, we've been exploring said lake of rot with the aid of the lovely boluses that we are able to craft. Unfortunately, we are running low, so I guess I should craft some more. It's preserving, right? Yeah. It's not like I have infinite of these things. Sacramental buds, exceedingly rare to find. How the fuck do you explore this if you don't have any of these bangers? I guess let's make another 10 and see how we go. I think the answer is you don't. I think you just don't explore this joint if you don't have any preserving. Which means we got to be quick about it. Because we ain't got infinite tries. To explore. Ah, oh, motherfucker. Really thought I could make that. It's always timed like... Oh my god, okay. It's almost always timed. Precisely so that you can't... Like, it will just pop as you get there. Although, that being said, that is a lot more to do with... Well, no, actually, that's, no, health doesn't affect that. Okay, well, I want these, so it's got to be done. So, our next stop is over that way. I really want to go in there. I mean, if it feels like we're running out of the boluses, we'll have to go in there. I should probably also... Eh, how many flasks do I have? I have seven of those, none of those. I was going to say I should probably actually go back to the grate and rest before I go in there. Because we can sprint through all the death frogs, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Fuck you, death fro- Oh god, there's multiple. No, I didn't mean to roll into the fucking thing again. Okay, my goodness. They take a bit to kill, don't they? Try bow. Golden Rune 9, okay. You know what? There's been a lot of Golden Runes down here. No shortage of Golden Runes. Okay, now the next one is a long way away. That is a massive way away. Is there really no more of the lift platform button thingies? I think we've hit them all. I wonder if you drop anything. You're just so far out there. That's the shore, right? You know what? It's probably actually closer. Let's go... Let's teleport back to here. It's probably closer to get there from here. Oh my god. <laughs> All the way out there, huh? All the fucking way out there. All the fucking way out there. Let's see, let's see. It's gonna be something shit. You just know. Whoops. You just know it's gonna be something shit. Oh my god, I have 62,000 souls. You know what? Let's spend that. Let's get the big 50, boy! Bada bing, bada boom. The big 50. 
now I actually need to think about maybe not doing that anymore. We have put, like, the last 20 levels into Vigor or something? Actually, no, we did put a couple into Mind, because I wanted it to be even. <laughs> but, uh... I say even. It's an odd number. Making it even, like, as a... Multiple of five, which is not what even means, so shut up. <laughs> um, what was I saying? I've just fucking stunlocked myself. I have no idea what I was saying. Cool. Okay, let's try not to use any boluses here. Let's just chug potions. We're going to run there, we're going to run there, and then we're going to teleport back to the grace. Aeonian Butterfly. Apparently I've used this before. I do not remember. Okay, that's very useful for counteracting the rot. Like, it still obviously is ticking down, but it's ticking down a lot more slowly than it was. Okay, while we're out here, let's not teleport back yet. Let's look around. You know what? This is fine. This is working. This is working. We don't need the boluses. We're all good. We are smart individuals who don't need no bolus. Fuck off. Oh yeah, we have been rewarded for our perseverance. Oh god! Oh god, I didn't realize it was still going down. Oh, it's just a smithing stone. Fuck me. Uh. Okay. Nothing over there. Oh god, what if there's a secret in the wall? It's gotta be tried. It's gotta be tried. Narrator, there was definitely no secret in the wall. Okay, so that is the bit of rock that we were at. Let's check these trees. Anything around these trees? Does not appear to be bees. Anything around these trees? Some more flutabies. Hello, motherfucker. Do you drop anything, motherfucker, before I die? Immunizing horn charm, alright? Nailed it. Fucking nailed it. Fucking nailed it. Immunizing horn charm. Ah. Wait, was it the first one or was it the plus one? It was probably the plus one, right? Ah! Greatly raises immunity to poison and rot. Well, that's handy. That would have also been very handy. <laughs> I didn't even consider that I had something like that. The ancestral followers believe the horns of a long-lived beast continue to bud like antlers over and over again until the beast one day becomes an ancestral spirit. Well. Alright. Uh, slowly restoring HP is not doing that much for me at the moment. It is nice to have as, like, a background thing going up. But it honestly does take quite a while to raise now that my health bar is this big. So it's probably time to remove that, honestly. I don't know what else I'd have in place of it. I had a, was, there, was there one that gave me better jumping attacks? I think there was one that gave me better jumping attacks. Or maybe I was thinking of final hit of chain attacks. It was something to do with what I'm using. It might have been that that I was thinking of. P 
poisoning or rot in vicinity increases attack power. That would have probably been good against the boss there. Yeah, no. Not what I was thinking of. But let's definitely put that on. Greatly raises immunity. Oh man, right, yeah, look at that health bar. Look at that. That, what do you call it? Not health, you know what I mean. The other thing. Okay, so we have done everything that we can over that side. I think all that remains, I think, is to grab the thing over here in the rot. And then... Oh, man. Yeah, that's a huge amount more bar. Jesus. I mean, we're still going to get done when we try and grab that, but... Oh, I forgot about these fuckers. All right, you know what? We're just going for it. We're just going for it. Fuck them. Don't care. Did not ask. Black key bolt. Apparently, we've already got some of them. And, of course, the old stone. No enemy ahead. Interestingly, though, having a longer immunity bar, meaning it takes longer for your poison, your rot to hit you in the first place, it also means it takes longer to stop affecting you, right? Because it only stops when that bar hits zero. And because that bar is longer, it's a lot longer until you hit zero. So that's curious. That's a little quirk of it, I guess. Right, now, I hope there's a grace over here. Because we're about to just fucking... Push on through. And we will be very lacking in health potions when we get there. Severely lacking, some might say. Right, we definitely hit that. There's no items around here that I can see. Look at these fucking statues, man. Super cool. Super cool shit. There's also a door over there. Maybe grace? My kingdom for a grace? Wait, what was that? Oh. Nope. Chest. Pop one of those. Whilst we grab this. Cheeky blue. Nomadic Warriors Cookbook 22. What the fuck are you doing out here? Nomadic Warriors Cookbook 22. What does this say? A great lake of standing water downstream of the Ainsel River. It is said that the divine essence of an outer god is sealed away in this land. Fucking pardon me. The divine essence of an outer god. Hang on a minute. That map. Oh. Interesting. I've only just been looking here. And it's so far off the bottom that you have to go like way off to see it. So I've been looking at this thinking it didn't give any more. But it also adds this bit. Which is not rotified. How'd you get from there to there? I just saw it on the fucking... Map thingy. I was like, wait, let's see that. An essence of an outer god is sealed away in this land? The fuck does that mean? An outer god. We've read most of these, haven't we? I think there might be a couple we never got to. Melania, Blade of Mikola. And they are the other two... Uh, fuck, I've forgotten the word. The other two things that Ronnie said. The dragons that escaped the Scarlet Rot made a nest of the plateau. Thus it was named Dragon Barrow, and none dare to enter. 
grave of civilizations that flourished before the Erd Tree. That's what I was saying. I was saying it felt older than the Erd Tree. Maybe I was just remembering it from that, or maybe I had an original idea. Who knows? Scars from the Shattering remain. We read most of these. Okay. I'm a little bit worried about what the fuck it could mean about houses the essence of an outer god. If I was an outer god, I think I'd live in there, where the big fucking statues are. What does an outer god even look like? Did we ever press that one? I don't think we ever pressed that one, did we? Oh, fuck it. Oh, shit. We going up, boy. Okay. Okay. That was unexpected. But most welcome! I say, that is most welcome of a development. Is there anything even up here? There's something up here. Hello? Friend? Not friend. Not friend. Really not friend. Oh, it's one of these pricks! I remember you! I actually do remember you. How the fuck did that not hit me? Oh my god, what is this? That looks gorgeous! Alabaster Lord's Sword. Is that what he is? Is he an Alabaster Lord? Where it at? Where it at? Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Strength, Dex, and Int. Interesting. Interesting. Great sword forged from a blue-white meteoric ore. The blade conceals gravity manipulating magic. A weapon unique to the Alabaster Lords, a race of ancients with skin of stone who were said to have risen to life when a meteor struck long ago. Huh. Thrust the armament into the ground to create a gravity well. In addition to dealing damage, this attack pulls enemies in. Has a greater area of effect than gravitas. Don't know what the gravitas is. Maybe a spell or maybe a skill on another weapon? So, the Alabaster Lords, of which he is one of them, race of ancients, very old, risen to life when a meteor struck long ago. And we've seen... Is it just one of them? I was thinking of a different thing. No. I was thinking he looked like an ancient hero. He didn't look like an ancient hero. He looked like the dude that we fought in the Weeping Peninsula. There was like a little bit of area, a little bit of ground like 
riddled with holes like a meteor struck there, and there were people, and then they summoned that guy, or they were like worshipping or praying to that guy. I think. If memory serves, I think it does. Somber Smithing Stone 9. That is, uh, that is big. The biggest. The biggest and the best. It's the biggest and the best. The biggest and the best. Is there any way of resetting that? Oh, God. I don't think there's a way to reset that. It's a one-time chance. I think that's a one-time chance. If he kills you, like, none of the other raised platforms have gone back down. Well, actually, I haven't died, so... Maybe they do. I've just teleported out. But dying usually just has the same effect as... Uh, resting does. Imagine if that's a... You have one chance to complete it, and if you don't... That's it. You never get that item. That's brutal. Let's see if I can stand on it again to reset it. I haven't tried standing on any of them twice, because why would you? But for this one, it might save me a bunch of fall damage, which would be most appreciated. Well, actually, it looks like there's a path down there? Huh. Ah, never mind. Never fucking mind. There is a way. Yeah, you can't... Can't tread on it twice. Makes sense. I don't think I'd survive uh, jumping all the way down to the rot, so... We gotta go this way. I hear a shiny. You motherfucker! Oh no, frogs. Gonna say, not worth. I'm gonna need a grace. I'm gonna need a grace. Grace ahead. <sighs> and then try left. Oh, thank you. Oh, fucking waterfall of rot. Come on, bro. Just let me have it. <laughs> One preserving bolus. Oh, you fucking spoil me. Gee. Thanks. Oh my god. There is stuff down there. Definitely don't forget that that exists. Although actually it looks like you can maybe walk around to it. How did you die, mate? Oh, everyone everyone who dies around here is just going to be dying to Scarlet Rot. <laughs> they can see the grace. It's so close. And then they just don't quite make it. Oh, man. That's a fucking pain in the dick, isn't it? That is very unfortunate. Oh, my God. That is, that is an old-looking building. That is a pain right in the todger. The Grand Cloister. Oh, fuck me. That's a cool-ass name. The Grand Cloister. Oh my god, it goes so deep. And you can go down there, because there's fucking messages down there. There's people down there. Oh god. The Grand Cloister. Okay, before we go down, do it layer by lever. Le lever, 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 lever. 
Layer by layer. What's over here? Fuck all? Ah, I see. Let there be Scarlet Rot. Indeed. Cool. Great discovery. Moving on. Holy shit. If I was an outer god, <laughs> as I was saying, the Grand Cloister, oh man. If I was an outer god, I would be in there. Underground tomb. So cool, man. <laughs> How'd you fuck that up, mate? How did you fuck that up? Seriously. You should be embarrassed. You really should. Hello. Golden Rune 10. Can't get enough of them. Wait, so where's the way down then? <laughs> I thought the way down would be over here, but apparently not. Uh, do I just have to drop here? Did he just not have enough health? I guess he just didn't have enough health. Behold bug in a grand cloister. Makes sense. Everything is placed with care and precision. Now this, I don't know that I can jump. I mean, I'll give it a go, but... I don't think I can make this jump. Oh, I can. Fuck you. Oh, and there's nothing there. Fuck me. Didn't expect dead end. Imagine not being rewarded. How dare. How very dare. Unacceptable. This is absolutely unacceptable. Uh. Okay. Down we go, I guess. Oh, no. It's these fuckers? Oh, God. I hadn't twigged. Oh, that's a lot of them. Oh, that's going to be really hard. How the fuck do I take on that many of those fuckers at once? That's a lot of fuckers. Let's run away from them to begin with. Oh, good. There's more over here. Well, one by one. Okay, uh, I don't want to use our boluses if we don't have to. What is happening? Something's shaking. Oh my fucking Christ! How fucking dare you? I don't even know what this is. Oh no, I think I know what this is. Oh, okay. Well, that sucks. Uh, let's try and get the items. Got him. That is the same thing we fucking found at the bottom of fucking Stormvale. That is the same fucking thing we found at the bottom of Stormvale. I thought it was Godwin at the time. I no longer think it was Godwin. God damn! Okay, let's not fuck with him. Let's go ahead and absolutely not fuck with him. I just shat a brick. Multiple, in fact. What the fuck was happening? I, I just... Gravity just affected me, like, more than usual. <laughs> Is what it feels like happened there. That was really weird. I just got slammed into the ground. Okay, so going down there triggers him. I don't need to trigger him again because I already got the shit, so that's good. Anything interesting over here? I can summon Broski. I still haven't fucking upgraded my fucking flask. Maybe I should summon Broski and take that bitch out. I feel like I'd need to take all these bitches out before I take that bitch out, though. There's a lot of bitches. I'd need to be able to fight him on this bit of land without any of these guys coming to pay me a visit, you know? I'd also definitely summon for him. 
I keep finding reasons to not try and beat them without my summon, but like, that's going to be such a pain in the ass. It's what, it's a massive, assuming it is the same, which I'm pretty sure, I didn't get a great look at it, but I'm pretty sure it's the same thing under Stormvale. That was a fucking pain in the dick trying to tell when it, what its moves were. It was glitching into the walls half the time. Do you really walk all the way up here? Like, I thought I was safe, but apparently, apparently you just walk all the way up here. And frankly, I'd consider that rude. Bro, I'm round a corner, you can't do this. Sucks. Bruh. Bruh! Look alive, sunshine. Your turn next. Hello, Billy Big Balls! It's me! Brian Bigger Balls! Disclaimer. Name's not Brian. Just needed to think of something that came up came with B attached. Okay, I don't think any of the others go no, all the others are like just happy praying down there. So maybe we should try this? Wow, super lucky that I had enough health to survive that, because I, every time, forget that that is, uh, it uses your health. Every time. Pests Glaive, you say? Also, can this Scarlet Rot stop going up? That'd be fantastic. Pests Glaive. There it is. Somewhere. I just saw it, didn't I? Didn't I just see it? Damn it, maybe I didn't. Fuck. There it is. Uh, strength dex. Glaive made from a hard, sharpened shell. Wielded by the pests who emerged from the swamp of Aeonia. Interesting. So these guys... I would have thought that they originated here. At the fucking rot home. The home of rot. But they actually emerged from the swamp of Aeonia and then travelled here. Though men might recognise the keen intellect of the pests, evidenced by this spear's uncanny design, it will never be understood by them. Or, that's rubbish, and it's just that there's a lot of pests in the swamp, so they expect you to get that drop there and not question it. God damn it. Didn't spawn him. Well, I guess I'll just have to use another fucking bonus, huh? Did that still not spawn him? Are you joking? Oh, he has a lot of health.
Jesus fuck. I don't think I could do this. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not using my fucking thing. Oh, what? The stagger? Oh my god, it does nothing! He's got so much health! Oh my god, he got staggered again. Go, go, gadget. Stagger team. Ow. That hurt. Oh my god, he's glowing with rot. Holy shit. The fact that that does that little damage is a real bummer. <laughs> Holy shit. How about you, like, attack? Oh, God. What's he doing? Okay, that's fine. My guy is still active. Oh my god, we got him. Wow. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, he does drop a golden seed. Same as the one under Stormvale. I was hoping. Wasn't sure, but I was hoping. Didn't drop anything else though. But still, that's a fucking... Golden seed is a rare fucking thing. Will not turn up our nose at a fucking seed of gold. Seeds of gold. That was great. Well done, my young Padawan.